My name is Jim, and this is Nathan. And welcome back to the Adventurers Lounge. Yes. Do you have any couch music to play? Huh? Oh, with the elevator music? What? Oh, I feel like this. If it's a lounge, there should oh. be some. Jim and Nathan do the games. Welcome back to Gilded Youth. Ah. I'm your host, Deckard K. <laughs> he died. Don't, don't make light of his life. Okay. Uh, you can see Harry the Barbarian so and everyone. Who ha- Paula? We haven't quite got Paula yet. Paula Dean. I feel like when show that shit to all of them. Show pocket. Just watch type what she fuck. To Maximus. Maximus the cleric. An exquisite item. I It'll know help you check off the it. hours you'll spend in hell for your evil ways. What oh the my fuck, dude! Look at him. He's like fucking. <laughs> His eyes like. <gasps> oh, they're ASCII graphics. ASCII graphs. Yeah. That's the idea. He's been the man who's condemned anyway. The Oakfield Manor. I know that grand old place. Maxima says he agrees to join your. So you fucking going to hell? And he's like, yeah, okay, come on. Dice are stupid anyway. No skill. Oh, that's Harry. Oh, wait, Harry's the barbarian. Um, dice are stupid anyway. (laughs) No, Maxima struggles with his vows of serenity. Hi, Tony. Show Tony the letter opener. Show Paula the letter opener. Show Paula letter opener. Uh, Pretty pretty. Pretty pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty. I, I do like a lot of correspondence. correspondence. Just says, That's enough backup. Log out. Lopgout. Lopgout. It's the new word. You uh, mean Max? Oh Jesus! He was the. He was this one, wasn't he? He was. No, but you're going to hell with your crimes. He's Sean Connery. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you meet Max at the edge of the field. He lives not too far away, but neither you really want to give his butt. He's a few years older and about a foot taller. <laughs> You're carrying a backpack. His voice was as annoying as you imagined from the beat. <laughs> yeah. You, you want to take that one? You're quite sure it's unpatrolled. If it gets traced back to the guild, they can easily shut <gasps> Dust down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. You um, let your tail field feeling rather than hearing it's like, oh, I'm super, super, super. Yeah. Just, keep on look at the wires. Way. Look at those fucking wires. We're going to do it. Wise. First taking wise. wise. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you. Oh, okay. Uh, even the oh, wild wild. oh, God. So enlightened. Oh, fuck. Dude, they put that hat on like at the last second. That it's like, yeah, we'll just slap <laughs> yeah, that on. That works. Fuck um, perspective. Even crowded and wild birds, the grandest building. I think it'd be awesome if it lives in North Polar. You assume it's Polar. Man, she looks more like a goth than a witch. Polar, you assume it's Polar. Okay. Hello, boys. <laughs> Are you ready to knock over this giant? You nod. <laughs> you don't know what to say. Okay, Polar sounds like fucking. Oh, what's her name? Hello. No, from Arrested Development. I don't know. Liza I... Minnelli. She looks like Liza Minnelli. Really? Yeah. I don't I haven't seen that enough to know her voice. Max glances at the paper. I'd like to say that my only interest in entering this building is to preserve... Shut up! <laughs> no, it's a stagey yawn. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> she, then she died. You can leave before to go to south. North. 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 Maybe N works. The curving staircase. Okay, west. you got to go back to that room because you got back up now. W? Oh, it does work. You can just add W. I fucking love these games. E. Um... First, let's go to the wine cellar. Where's that? It's a map. Ah, first things first. Let's find the wine cellar. E. Doors closed. You don't remember behind you. Oh. Oh. You did. Open door. Look door. I don't want to open this shit yet. Open door. What? Look. Just look. Curving staircase. Uh, used to lead to the second floor. Strange shapes. Uh, east and west. Well, I guess we mm-hmm. just have to west go east again. Then. No, west is not good. Doors locked. You don't remember yeah. closed. West, west. Oh. It's, she said she wants to go to the wine cellar. Where the fuck's the wine cellar? Um, fuck. Look again. I think we have to... Go south. around the back, maybe? Yeah, I think we have to south out again. Do that northeast path. Man, it has, still has loot. Fuck, north? West? Go cellar. Uh, look. Just look. We'll see if we can get any clues. Okay, curving staircase. Strange, Strange shapes. shapes. Uh, look shapes. We already did that though. That's just like furniture and shit. You touch them, please. That's right. Yep. That seems thicker. Harry yanks one off and spends a full oh. minute rubbing his eyes and coughing. For his trouble, he's revealed a couple of unremarkable chairs. The thief instincts tell you that there's nothing. Uh, but take chairs. Furniture. 
Uh, the chairs. Yeah. Here we go. You touch them in a point with dust chairs. The dust actually seems thicker than the sheets themselves. Oh, same thing. Uh, okay. Go chairs. <laughs> go chairs. Just touch chairs. Uh, fuck. Okay, so what's east? Just Fuck e. me. Just E. No, I'm, I want to see if maybe I'm wrong about that. No, door's closed. Unlock door. Um, look door. Nope, I guess we can't do that. Uh, so west is... Uh, talk to her. Talk to her, Paula. You'd rather not fill the air with idle chatter. Ask Paula... About seller. seller. No, ask Paula about seller. Oh, ask... About seller. Unless you really need to go doing something. Fuck you. Give me that shit. Give me that shit. This is too much for me, man. Annex. You come up with a huge ragged hole. You come up to the huge ragged hole that makes me. Oh, hole. that's the hole that we the fucking. What's the face went in? Go hole. Go hole. Go hole. There we go. Okay. Um. Max, wait, that's not something we can enter, but I guess Max went She's down She's about there. to say something when you... Oh, I guess we There's a tense west. moment. W. Wait, didn't Paula want to go into the cellar? No, Maxwell did. Okay. Paula's a fucking... Goth. Goth. Goist. Yeah, they like wine, right? Weast. <laughs> you stop outside the dining room, and there's a dinner party going on. Yes, I recognize him too. Oh, no, shit. No, it's her. Yes. No, no, no. What, is that a voice? How does she talk? We settled the voice. She's like Liza Minnelli. Yeah, we did. Well, I don't know how to do that. Well, fuck. You do it then. Before you can contest, she adjusts her hat. <laughs> squeak, squeak. That's her adjusting her hat. And squares her shoulders. <laughs> and strides in the... Do- Wait, seriously? <laughs> she's just fucking walking in there? Yeah, she's confident. She, she knows people. Uh, there are six people around the large table. The guys from yesterday plus a couple more. The girl with a strange bang. The guy with a strange bang. Oh. Uh, he's too, too beautiful, beautiful to look at. Look, girl. Look, goth girl. Look, beauty. Okay. Um. <laughs> oh, dead. Girl. 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 So, wait. Wait, we haven't finished reading all this stuff yet. Yeah. There's a goth girl who's too beautiful to look at. The table is laid out beautifully. And the candle black. Oh, you're beauty. sitting down with them. Uh, but she started eating. Paula the mage here. Paula sits down, empty chair. And seats you beside her. There's no plate, but she reaches across the table and wrenches a drumstick from the bird. Okay, so you sit down, you look at the beautiful girl, but you can't. There's a dreadlocked guy with a large beard. Um, hi. Says the fellow in the suit jacket. Everyone's staring at Paula as she gnaws the drumstick. And you will yourself invisible. <laughs> she, points at the drumsti- she points the drumstick at him, and you see a drop of grease. You stole my idea, Eric, and then you didn't even invite me. Talk, Eric. What? <laughs> uh, you'd rather not... Um... <sighs> What happened? Uh, look. Uh. Oh, Maximus is back. There's six people, the goth, you can see Paula. Well, I would say it was our idea. Paula reaches over and takes the closest goblet. Its bespectacled owner prevents, pre- pretends he doesn't notice. She takes a sip and spits it out. White with duck, Eric. Give me there out of Then suddenly I see Maximus Dolly with a bottle of wine. Take one. Oh. I did. A bottle of white wine. Dude, you're reading this like a fucking retard. You're skipping... <laughs> you're reading all the shit words and skipping the good words. I'm sorry. Ah, smellia. Paula waves him over. It's a type of wine. Yeah, I know. I knew that. Let's just slow down. <laughs> Max comes, his eyes shunted, and only squeaks a bit as she pulls the dusty bottle from his grasp. She sets one on the table, reads the label on the other, Max backs away towards the door, and then makes a break for it. Okay. Well, fucking pussies. Look, and he stole the rest of Look around again. That seems to be the only way to advance stuff. Uh, ah, a pinot, a pinot noir. <laughs> a pinot. Pinot. Uncorking pinot with surprising noir. ease. That's suitable for duck. So they need a duck wine. Uh, okay, I didn't know there were such things as duck wine. She goes around the table picking and up a couple. There's chocolate wine, there's coffee wine, there's wine for everything. Fuck that. What's there's the point of doing wine? something? If you're not going to do it, go all the way with it. She fills the goblet and bangs it down on the table, sloshing red, and the cannabis sways a bit. Look again. I'm just sitting here, man. The rules are the least interesting part of this. You always take things too far. The dreadlocked man gulps down his white and holds it up for Paula, who overfills it. Whoops, guess I do. Looks like keeping me out of free cliche. Click. 
Is it actually... Click. Is that not cliche? A freak click. Freak click. Nathan, notice how it's got a Q in it? Yeah, I thought that's how you spelled the cliche. Also, what? The fucking mana is gone up the top there. Okay, what happened? Uh, it's pot. Look, Paul. I'm t- His voice... Oh, God. Me. A candle of her melting onto the white tablecloth. Oh, God. It's Paula, you stupid fuck. She throws the bottle at him. The last thing you see is a candle falling on the cloth. In a rush, you see the birds on the wallpaper. The front door still open. The flattened grass in front of you. And before too long, you're back in your bedroom. You take off your clothes. So you just run away because the whole place is just fucking burnt down. You're in your bed when the fire sirens start to wail. And blah, blah, blah. It's sad. You skipped two words. You skipped two words with blah, blah, blah. You fucking idiot. <laughs> it's sad. When you consider the man was otherwise facing crowbars and gruff hands and wrecking balls in the morning, better a funeral pie. So it was going to get demolished anyway and it's going to be burnt down. Three weeks later, you use your night for sleeping, not sneaking. Your modern, your modem neither winks or squeals. So you haven't been in touch with anybody for three weeks. And no one in the guild squeals either since the knock on the door never comes. When Ryan tells you something funny... Harry said online yesterday, you realize even if Ryan is sticking his head up, that the smoke has cleared. Oh, so Ryan's a puss, but he's fuck him. logging in, so you can log in as well. Oh, I type log in. Log in. You can see Harry and blah, blah, blah. Everyone's there. It was in last week's Guardian. It was in the papers. That free rag. I don't even believe the coupons in the Ibukuk. What? Ibukuk. Itobi Coke. Ibukuk. Ibukuk. Okay, that's enough then. I still at, have the wine. At this verboten talk, <laughs> verboten, <laughs> forbidden. Maximus brandishes his staff of banishment. Look, staff. Look, staff. Oh. Look, look, wine. The label is hard to read. Here, cops don't suspect arson. Mm, Paula rolls her eyes. Long time to see. Okay, what the fuck is? All right, show. Who should I? Who respects wine? <laughs> Chris. Paula. Paula. She Chris does, isn't she? Actually, no. Let's 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 leave Chris to last. She's a special person. For some reason, this feels like a significant choice. Ooh, Ooh. let's show Chris the wine and get her drunk. No, no, no. What? I, don't know. I like Maximus. <laughs> you want to get Maximus drunk? <laughs> yes, I want to no, corrupt fuck, him. The fuck fucking that guy. Gib. Ryan's such a puss. I should have give Ryan the wine. He's what? a puss. Paula blows a tiny kiss. Paula blows Tony a kiss. Dude, show it to Ryan. Why? Because Ryan's a puss and give him the wine. But dude, we almost made it with Chris. Alright, go Chris. We almost made it with Chris. Get a drunk. <laughs> Alright. Yes. Boom. Well, well. For some reason, this feels like a never going to Well, well. Thief. You arranged me tonight. Oh, oh shit, dude. Low, low, low boy. <laughs> Uh, you Just start smell. smelling the burned manor from the forest. Guilt and Guilt excitement. Guilt and excitement can be in your belly as you emerge. That's most of my life right there. <laughs> Guilt and excitement. Guilt and excitement. <laughs> the ring of brush is blackened. The manor's roof is caved in, beaten to its knees by the fire hose water. They must have gotten here quickly as there's good chunks of the eastern wing. They're mostly still intact. Fucking really? Okay. Northeast. Uh, and just like What ne. if we go east? Ne. Ne. Nis. Double doors are large enough to drive a hot... Yeah. Double doors. The small structure seems to far enough away to be spared the fight north. N. <laughs> you, missed, you misspelled N. <laughs> With M. There's a significant hole. Yep. Chris isn't here. You look up through the roof, feeling like a jackass. When you turn to leave, you see her in the doorway. Had to make sure it wasn't a setup. She sits down in the wooden crate and pulls tumblers. Dude, she's fucking ready. How old are these people? <laughs> Smell them. Wine me. Wine me. Later that night, drunk, she chews you out for not including her in your scheme to burn down the manor. You explain that it wasn't a scheme, and then you would never include her in schemes. She makes you a pinky promise, and then pinky wrestle, and then the kissing, and then the rubbing, and then the puking. Oh, okay. Well, oh, uh, so you get a bit of rubbing. Yeah, you get good enough. But it's only the beginning of your scheming together. After a particularly successful scheme, eight years later, the two of you lie in bed with a view of the Mediterranean, tracing the route of what got you there. From Master Thieves banging youth. in a bed. I think that was a cool game. The, this LA Game Space Game Pack Edition allows you to skip to the end and choose another drinking companion with the oh, magic word lags. lags. Hit refresh and your browser play again. No. Do you want the ultimate endings? No, what is the Let's one? keep the mystery. If you guys, you guys can play it and get the other ending, you can buy LA Game Space, type lags, and check the other endings. But I think we found the best one. Or maybe we'll do it off camera and we'll get Maximus strong. Yep, we're gonna do that. <laughs> Jim is not confident in my ability to be I'm bothered to do that. I'm the fuck out of my head right now. 
Thank Same, you for watching this enough. epic adventure. I really enjoyed that. It that was, was really, really cool. It was, it, was, it was a view into childhood and being a, a fantasizing, weird, out of your depth kid. The choices were limited, but no, it, took, it sucked me in a little bit. Maybe not a lot happened. Maybe children's choices are limited in life, Jim. That's true, actually. Whatever. I'm, I'm, I'm You're Jim. knocking around. I'm Jim. And I'm Nathan. Yeah, he did it. <laughs> <laughs> said his own name and we'll do the games and thank you for joining us goodbye